Hey everybody. So, earlier today I was on Tumblr and I saw a post about feminism, and usually when I see a post about feminism I just let it pass by, I don't stop and look at it. But today, the post that I saw was a project done on Cambridge University's campus, and what it was called was, I Need Feminism Because. And I saw all sorts of posts, some that I agreed with, some that I didn't. But several of the photos that I saw were regarding men and women who were writing about equality, specifically in career choices and job placements. It's not something I had really thought about all that much before, but I'm an English major, so most of the people that are my classmates, and the people is the same major as I have, are women. And it's such a stereotypical thing here to be getting a degree in English if you're a female. But what about the men? And then, afterwards, a lot of the time, when it comes to writing, it's usually the men you hear the most about, not the women. But I don't want to be told that I can't publish a book under my own name because I'm a female, and be told to take a male pseudonym. It still happens all the time, and it doesn't make sense to me. I want it to be different. And I know that the only re real way that it's going to change is by people like me and my classmates stopping and realizing that this is still a problem and that we can break the stereotypes and we can do great things no matter who we are, male or female, no matter the skin color or where we come from. I want to be able to break the bond of my hometown, of my gender, and of everything stereotypically expected of me. Because I don't want to be the same as the stereotype. The stereotype honestly seems really boring to me. I want to live an extraordinary life. And yeah, that might not mean living my name in the spotlight, but it means doing what I love and helping people see that things can change in this world. They don't have to be how they are right now. Also, another thing that people are constantly treating me differently because is my health problems. And I know in some cases I do need to be treated differently, otherwise bad things could happen. But overall, when people find out that I have so many health problems, people automatically start treating me like I'll break with the smallest poke. And that's not what will happen. Like, yeah, I need to be careful. Yeah, I can't er eat certain foods and stuff like that. But I've lived this far. 21 years old. I can survive. I know this is a rather controversial topic, but I would really like to know what your opinions on the matter are. And if there are other changes that you would like to see, whether it deals with stereotypes or not, what some of those changes that you would like to see in the world are, please leave comments and interact with me. I really, really want to know what you guys think. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next week.